What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm Brian Garcia Torado and this is Torado Racing. So in today's video, we're gonna dive right in. I got a new set of wheels from Vicrez, which are Hellcat reps for the Dodge Ram 1500. So let's take a look. All right, so these are Hellcat replicas because Dodge doesn't make actual Hellcat wheels for a Dodge Ram 1500. So either way, if you go 20 inch, 22s or 24s, you're gonna end up getting a Hellcat replica wheel. Now there's no modifications you need to do to install these wheels on your Ram 1500. They are 22 by 10 and the tires that I'm running are 305, 40, 22. So it's a little bit of a bigger tire, but the wheels come in a good offset, so you don't have to do any trimming or anything like that. And you might notice my truck is just a little bit lower. That's because I am running a DJM uh, drop kit. So it's three inch drop in the front with a lower control arm and a five inch drop in the rear. Now, even though the truck sits lower and these tires do have a little bit of a bigger or similar diameter to the stock wheel size, it doesn't rub much. So if you hit a really big dip with a three five drop, you are gonna hear a little bit of rubbing on the front fender liners. One important thing to note, and this is really important because I couldn't figure out for the life of me what it was, is that the pockets where the lug nuts go are shallower than with the stock wheels. So if you have these stock lug nuts, one, throw them away. They are no good. They're chrome capped and eventually the chrome will strip off and then you got a bit of a problem on your hands. So I ended up getting some deeper lug nuts from O'Reilly's. They were like $60 and it fixed the wheel not sitting up tight against the brake rotors. So if you do use these lugs, what you're gonna have is a bit of a rattle and when you go over bumps, you're gonna hear that the wheel isn't on there tight. So do yourself a favor, get some acorn style, which is gonna be just like this, uh, longer lug nuts and that's all you really need. So the wheels are 22 by 10 and you can find them on vicres.com and the part number is VZN118. 496 and they are five by five and a half bolt pattern or five by 139.7 and again you can find those at bikecrest.com all right guys that's going to wrap up today's video like i said short and sweet if you like these videos make sure to hit that like button leave a comment below and hit that subscribe button until next time guys peace out